time to weigh some lambs and hopefully I have some ready to go or else me and the bank manager I think are going to fall out. Just for the crack, I'm going to see if this dog will work for me. I don't think she will. That's why our Tom is here. We'll try it and see. Jeff, come here. Jeff, come back. Jeff, come back. <laughs> she doesn't like me, like. Jeff, come here. Come back. I think we'll leave it to El Tom. See, I said nothing different to what he said. Dog works for him, not for me. Dad? Bye bye. I think Isle Tom is definitely Jess's favourite anyway. Come on. <whistles> stay. Jess, stay. Call her in. It's a great lamb whenever it can fit through the gate. Right, the plan of attack is to separate off the blackface and the mule yule lambs. The price of lambs at the minute isn't that cheap or oh, isn't that dear. I was intending basically on selling all the lambs, but because the price isn't that exciting, the yule lambs, I'm going to split them off, let them run all a bit. Maybe in a month's time, still could sell them as breeders, or I may end up running them over the next year. But we'll get a lot of them pulled off first to a, to a sea. Didn't exactly go that well.
This might turn into a short video because it's been a bit awkward today. Messed out with these white vermin and trying to record stuff as well. But basically, we got them weighed, and as you'll see in here, there's a lot more sheep that aren't ready compared to what there is. I only have 20 to go, which was a lot less than I was hoping for. But the 20 to go, we'll get them fired out to this wee paddock here anyway. This is the 20 that's ready to go. I was hoping that I had about maybe 50 ready to go. These lambs did weigh heavier. There were some of them were coming in, you know, around the 50 kilo marks. But the rest in the shed were not weighing at all. Like was, that batch there probably could have went a couple of weeks ago, three weeks ago. When I'm taking the sheep to the market, I normally do. I wouldn't just put them away at the sort of 42 kilo live weight, hoping to get 21 dead weight. When taking them to the market, I always like to have them maybe that extra couple of kilos just seem to sell that wee bit better. Like I say, they weighed out well. Putting them through there, they actually were heavier than I thought, but then some of the other ones, they were just a lot lighter. And uh, I don't know when they're gonna be ready. Like I really hoped that I was gonna have at least 50 of them away. On a wee bit of a downer now. I'll be grand. Another month, will, there'll be more to go. It's just even taking cattle and sheep to the market, it's eating up time and that too. Like you'll be fit to see a couple of wee lambs in there that's none but screws to be honest and you'll know that yourself looking at them. Hopefully the only thing by the time they're ready, hopefully the lamb price is well back up again. The blackface, ram lambs, not even talk about what, what they weighed. The the Charlies as you would expect, Charlie Cross would outweigh them but that wasn't what the, the blackface's purpose was for, like it was getting the old lambs. Dad, I think he disappeared way off. He must have had them shifted already. Uh, the old lambs there down to the bottom field. These will go back out into a fresh field here, a bit of fresher grass. Hopefully I'll take them on a wee bit. But my barley wasn't a success this year and the sheep isn't really looking too profitable either. But it's the joys of it and we'll give ourselves the torture. I'll get this batch back out to the field on the fresh grass. Hopefully try and count them as they're coming through the gate. Don't know. Huh? Don't know. I don't know. There's too many. Too many came through. If you're still watching and you like watching me torment myself working with sheep, hit the subscribe button, ring the little bell, and I'd be appreciated if you give us a thumbs up. Also, leave a comment below. I read all the comments. So if you have any questions or anything you want to tell me, I'm doing stupid, which especially with sheep, there's probably plenty of things I'm doing wrong. But we'll see you again next week. <laughs>